in my life, you've never had a Christmas tree in my life, in my house. What is they? What is what is that? Where they want to come? Hey guys, what's up and welcome to Vlogmas Day Four. I hope I'm able to keep this energy up until the 25th of this month at least. Okay, so what's up and welcome to Vlogmas Day Four. I hope you guys enjoyed yesterday's vlog. I hope you enjoyed the first one, the second one, and yesterday being the third one. Today is the fourth one, and this house, this house, ah, this is the fourth time I'm filming my entry. Hello, mommy. Okay, mom. It's what I'm starting to hear The whispers reach in my ear Good and big So I hope you guys enjoyed the day one, day two and day three Today is day four and I just thought of doing something really different Instead of going out to vlog again because I miss sitting down in front of an actual camera Like a real time camera I, know, I hope you guys know that I've been filming with my newest camera that small one a very tiny camera it's so small and I really like it it has been doing well but I just wanted to sit in front of the camera to bring you this one now what we're going to be doing here today is going to be a Christmas slash holiday tag I don't know if that is what it's called but I stumbled on a youtuber has vlogmas and she did an holiday tag and i was like okay why not give this a trial let's roll into it are you ready this is a christmas tag if you are new here please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video we are in the vlogmas series is that right what to use okay i'm doing vlogmas so i'm going to be posting videos every day from now until december 25th amen 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 in jesus name amen yeah, so let's get right to, into it. This one says the the only jolly Christmas YouTube tag. That is what it says here. And the first one goes favorite Christmas movie. I think growing up, my favorite Christmas movie has to be Omelu. I don't even know if it's a Christmas movie, but the first time I watched it was during Christmas, and I absolutely love that movie. I think that has to be like my favorite Christmas. Christmas movie. I've seen some other ones too, but that's still the best one I've seen. Are you on the naughty list or the nice nice list? I would say I'm on the nice list. I've really been nice this year. I think that's what it means. I've really been nice this year. Like I've really been very nice this year. So I'm definitely on the nice list. Show us an embarrassing Christmas photo. I don't have one. And now, before we even go further, I'm a Muslim. So, we don't celebrate Christmas. Not like we don't celebrate Christmas, but Christmas is very basic. I think the only celebration we have in my house is um, Eid al Fitr and Eid al Kabir. So, which is like it's Unawe and the Ilaya festival. But you see, Christmas, we only cook. If you want to go out, you go out. If you want to stay at home, even during the layer seven, it's no way. We are always at home. We cook and eat and sleep. Most of the time, I'm always sleeping after cooking. Make, not like I cook, I'll just assist and I'll go back to sleep. So, an embarrassing Christmas photo I don't have. Number four says, Have you ever had a white Christmas? I mean, I don't know what is even a white Christmas. Let's see. Oh. The presence of snow on Christmas. We're in Nigeria. There's nothing like snow here. Snow bow. No. I've never had one. Um the fifth one says, Do you start your Christmas shopping on Black Friday or you wait until the last minute? Well, I do not think I do any Christmas shopping, but um I shop a lot on Black Fridays. On Black Fridays. Sadly, this year I didn't buy one single thing because I was broke, broke, broke. I didn't buy a pin. When other beauty was doing sales, they had massive eighty percent discount, and I didn't buy a pin. I'm actually proud of myself. Now the sixth one is: if you could be in any Christmas movie, what would it be? Home Alone. I don't know the role I'm going to play, but I 
I don't know, but I would definitely love to be in that movie. I love being like, I love imagining myself in movies that I really, really do know. For me to even remember the title, I definitely love that movie. Now, name all the Santa's brain day. Brain day. Brain, brain there. I don't know. I don't know, but I feel like it's going to be some American thing. You see, the problem with most of all these um, tags is that they are abroad, abroad people. Oh, Santa's when they dash out, dance up, prance. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't, I've never heard of that. When, number nine, when does your when does your family put up your Christmas tree and who decorates it? In my life, you've never had a Christmas tree. In my life, in my house. What is they, what is, what is that? Where they want to come? Nothing. You don't have, like, well, I don't know. I, I hope I have money this year to buy a Christmas tree. Um, Christmas tree. I'm sincerely hoping I have money to buy it because I heard that it could be really, really expensive, like very expensive. I don't know, but <laughs> if I'm unable to buy it this year, we move, we'll try again next year. If I thought about, th if I had thought of doing vlogmas this year, I could have planned for it. Okay, but I'm going to try to price it. If it's not so pricey, then I'll buy it. But if it is, my dear, we move on. Is your Christmas tree real or fake? It has to be real. I don't know. Number 12. From 10, they jumped to 12. Okay. Number 12. Pecking at gifts or be surprised. Um, with Christmas, I've never actually received a gift for Christmas. Um, maybe once. Not like it was even a gift. Just a friend of mine. I think I sent him a dress and it was like, probably something later, I was like, Ah, buy for me a Christmas gift. I was like, okay, and sent me money. So I think I don't know. I don't know how it feels to receive this Christmas gift. How somebody can surprise me this year with with Christmas gifts. I'll appreciate it. Number thirteen, show us your ugly Christmas sweater if you have one. I don't have one. I'm sorry. Okay, number fourteen, we have if you could be under the mistletoe with anyone, who would it be? I think I'll be with the love of my life, but when I have one, shall because I don't have one at the moment. Number 15 says that your family have a special holiday recipe you like to help make. Yeah, we do. When it comes to like Itinuawe and um, Ilea, we always make fried rice. Like we make a whole lot of food, but the fried rice has to be my favorite. I don't eat out, like I really do not like eating out. But it, Especially when it comes to fried rice, I believe that the only, the best fried rice in this world is made in my house. Because you see all those restaurant fried rice, it's like curry fried rice. They don't even like put enough ingredients, except you kind of do all these special other food. But this Nigeria, most of their fried rice are uh, curry rice. So I don't really like it. And they have like a special recipe. I think my mom has one special recipe she uses and I absolutely love. I hope I like I love making it with them. Okay, so that could pass for that. Um number 16, how many minutes? Oh number 16. Or um, are you a pro present rapper or do you feel miserably? I think I can manage with wrapping gifts. I can't. I can't do well with that. I might not be a pro, but I can manage with that. Have you, excuse me, have you ever gone Christmas caroling? I'm hoping to go for Christmas carol this year. I already told Joy to invite me to a church if there's going to be any. So I would love, love, love to attend one this year. Um, The last time I attended one was like, when I was doing pretty grief, probably like 2011, 2012, when I was doing Pretty degree it was held at the school i guess yeah so i just had to attend and it was really nice i think it's usually fun it's not like it's not like the regular like um the church service so i think i enjoyed it number 18 what tops your three you know get three you know they buy three if i get money i will buy three this year number 19 do you make new year resolutions do you stick to them i've made i've made New Year resolutions over time, but <laughs> do I stick to them? I don't think so. But uh, I think New Year resolutions are quite overrated, in my opinion. It's good to have like New Year resolutions. It's very good 
to have goals that way you kind of know what you're planning towards and all but if you cannot stick with it please don't stress not everybody can write something down and say okay this is how this thing is going to go and it's going to go that way the most important thing is that we should pray to god that whatever we want aligns with whatever god wants for us okay i think that's the most important thing so yes i do make new year resolutions and no i don't stick to them 19 you have been you have been granted one wish you have 20 rather you have you have been granted one christmas wish what will it be <sighs> to be honest I, I i i i want a lot of things right now so if i could pick one a christmas wish right now five million naira. I just need someone to give me five million naira to be honest. I don't even want much. I think five million naira would do for a Christmas which right now. Which <sighs> if there's somebody out there watching this video that can give me five million naira, bro or sis, I'm going to change my son name to your son name. If you're okay with that. So yeah, I've answered um 20 questions. This is actually 19 because they missed one. So let me check for a random question from that other one um anyone 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 um okay let me answer the last one here what is most important to you about the holidays i love the fact that a lot of people you are able to meet with a lot of people you've probably not seen in the past i really don't know how christmas is being celebrated to be honest i just have a knowledge of us always visiting um my mom's friend that is a christian yeah we used to visit our friend during okay no it was during new year i think during new year so it's not christmas but i love the fact that you are able to meet with your family i'm a huge fan of family okay i really love my family i love my cousins and you know everybody that is related to me by blood or by surname or by anything i really love them so i like the fact that sometimes only they could bring everybody together not all the time because we don't get to see all the time so i love the fact that holiday could act can actually bring everybody together like from this place from this place and we can all meet merry you know have fun not talk too much because you know but then i think that's one of the things that i really like about the holiday it says what is most important to you i think it is being able to meet with a lot of people that you've not seen in a very long time okay so yeah now i've answered 20 questions and i'm like probably 12 minutes in so yeah i hope this was not boring if it is boring i promise to do better but please make sure you like this video okay thank you very much i hope you enjoyed this if you do please don't forget to subscribe to this channel like this video and i'm going to see you tomorrow day five we keep it moving babe we keep it moving get it late get it late so 20 more days no this is still day four right day four so 21 more days thank you very much i'm going to see you tomorrow bye oh christmas it's what i'm starting to hear the whispers reaching my ears of warm intention